when the house burned down, I was, like, it was just one of the hardest things that my family had to go through, because this is all that we had. We've been living in this house for 20 years, but, um, my grandparents, I told my grandparents that it was just a blessing in disguise and that something better was coming. which was now um, converted into part of the home, which gives them a family room. Um, they never had a pantry. I can't wait to show you that because it's almost as big as one of the bedrooms. Um, uh, uh, grandparents live on a modest mean anyway. Um, when they open their home to extra people, it just requires money that maybe they don't have to feed them. And so we wanted to support that mission and make sure that they had plenty of things to keep everyone fed and nourished. And we sent out an SOS call about... 10 days ago, and now this pantry has $1,500 worth of food in it. Growing up, we've had friends that, whose parents kicked them out of their house, and my grandma always, my grandparents both, just welcomed them here with open arms, and um, we were all raised together. All my grandma's kids, kids, all her grandkids were all raised together, and that's why we all call each other our brothers and sisters. There's 17 of us. At one point, there's 21 of us living in this house, and you know, we didn't have near as much food as there is here. And so it's just, it's just amazing. It's amazing. Honestly, like, I'm just happy for my grandparents because this is what they deserve. And um, financially, we just couldn't ever afford anything like this. And so, you know, it just comes to show that God is so good. And there's so good people out there. You know, we're just blessed beyond belief. And, you know, I'm just excited and I'm happy. Um, but more so for my grandparents. Because now they can re live the rest of their lives happy. And in a house that they deserve. 